What's up, YouTube? Top Shell P checking in. Back at you. Down here at Eminem Automotive checking out some of the projects they got down here. Looks like they're doing a quarter panel and front fender replacement on this 70 to 72 Cutlass Supreme. It's a pretty good work. Look at those seam wheels right there. Pretty good metal work. Whoever has to uh, paint it should have a fairly smooth surface to work with. Nice little project. It's a lot of, a lot of work getting dropped around here, man. It's mid South area. I'm about to go tap in in Arkansas to see what they're working with over there. But I know over here in Mississippi, in Tennessee, they doing their thing. Let's check on these other projects. Looks like he got a short wheel base squat by the truck up here. Looks like it's slammed. Ty, this truck look like it's been lured. It's a little lower. Factory color. Nice body too, man. Looks like a he swapped that hood out. Looks good, man. Oldmobile gang. That blue look good on that 98 photo. Got a bit of 76, I can tell by the pillar. And that back window got the top in it. OG engine. I tell y'all what, if it ain't broke, don't break it. Use a nice little cleaner, but uh, overall, it looks like a nice little paint job. This car looks for me. Looks like that. Mm, I think Ty painted this car once before. White Monte Carlo. I know you painted one this time last year, right before you got done with mine. Yeah. Plenty of projects. That's a Nova, Fox Body Mustang, Trans Am. This look like the one that's down there at Lynn Shop. Look like a C5 Corvette. It says Impala, and we know who this is. Walk dog, you checking in. You see the body work is in motion. Said I'm about to holler at him for you right now, brother. Oh yeah, whenever you see that spray right there, that indicates that the body man is in the process of blocking it. Um, I'm not a auto body fabrication guy by any means, but just being down here and getting familiar with the terminology, um, this, this process identifies as many waves or warps in the body, uh, which is very pivotal. As you all know, uh, when we went down there to get the content, Cuz said his uh, quarters worked on. And with these deltas, with there not being an aftermarket quarter available for it, you have to really get uh, cerebral or surgical with whatever modifications that you make because those contours make or break these cars, you know? For the, and I know a lot, like right here, looking at this angle right here, car looks uh, extremely straight, you know what I mean? But that's to the naked eye and there's no paint on it. Uh, like you said, you don't have the, uh, I forgot the name of that coating that he sprayed on. It's not spray paint, but whatever it is, it's, it's for that, but I forgot the name for it. If y'all know the name of it, uh, put it down in the comments. But yeah, once he puts that on, he'll be able to identify every or as many as possible uh, waves in the body. And he'll be able to uh, get that body straight. But yeah, cuz, I guess this is your update right here. I ain't got to text it, I ain't got to text it to you. Yeah, cuz got that new top on him, man. Crispy, crispy. He's in the process of uh, scheduling an appointment with a uh, Jazzy to get his trunk did. His console, front console, and his real console. He got a bad ass LS swap in his car. Door panels ain't hurt at all. Seats ain't hurt. All this is OG. Not one crack in the dash. Um, I hate I didn't get a chance to film this or let you guys know earlier, but Jack, the guy that does all the LS swaps for us, he, um, he went to Missouri, if I'm not mistaken, to pick this car up for Conte. Yeah, man. 
and she is for sale. Uh, uh, I don't know what number Cuz got on it, but he is interested in selling it. I mean, he gonna build it, sliding it in the meantime, but if anybody wants to buy him out of it, he is entertaining, respectable offers. You guys have already seen the LS swap, the undercarriage, the gas tank. Uh, you know, he didn't cut any corners, you know what I mean? Uh, like I said, you can go back and look at some of my previous videos on this car and you can see, you know, some of the work that's been put into it. And if you need any additional information, hit me up on Instagram at underscore top shelf P and I can forward you uh, Conte's contact information. But yeah, man, it's around here, man. Just got out work a little early. Wanted to come behind and check on some of these projects, man. Y'all tell me what you think. Like, comment, subscribe. I'm out. Ooh, gonna be a hot something.